Um, I'm going to show you guys like some of the counters to get out of lockdown. So watch your, watch your legs and legs on my right leg, guys. Um, so, of, of course, so it's better to avoid it. So if I'm in his half guard here, and I know he's going to start looking for it, I'm going to go ahead and take my, I tell him lifting his, his right leg with my left foot, but I can, I can hide my right foot by pulling it inside like this. Now he's going to try to look for the half guard uh, lockdown, but he can't get the lockdown because he can't find my foot. Now from here, I can cross face, rotate my hips. Block his legs, he's gonna try to come up, and I can pull my leg out, or I can even hook his leg here with my hand. Right, he's gonna try to come up, I'm gonna drive my shoulder forward and pull my leg out. So that's the first thing, is just defending it, right? It's defending it is always better and easier to try to escape it. Another option is, I'm here, I'm gonna tuck my, tuck my leg in, right, and he's in half guard, I tuck my leg in, but instead I can just here to fly, I can go through my tripod base, look to my path, you know, whatever pass you want to use for, for tripod base. Okay, so that's an option. And just try for, uh, tripod base uh, pass. Um, let's say he does get me in the lockdown. So he's got me here, he's got me in a tight lockdown, and I can't even go forward. It's impossible for me to pull my leg through. And not only that's gonna make it worse, because as I'm pulling, by trying to pull my leg through, he can come underneath my leg, he's got me in the electric chair, he can start you know, attacking my arms with the Kimura, he could start, he could throw his um, right arm around my neck for the, for the guillotine. Um, he can go to my back, right? So, so what I want to do, guys, if you look at my foot, I, I, have, I want to take my heel towards my butt and whip my leg out on the opposite side of where his leg is. So I'm going to get my knee to the mat. My hands are on Renee. I come up, out. See, now, now I scorpion tail my foot out. Now I can pull my knee through this hole. I need an underhook and pass this way. I can go to three quarter mount. I can go to full mount. So, again, and let's say he's got my leg the opposite, opposite way in the lockdown. My butt, I'm just gonna keep my knee on the mat, make my head on my butt. Scorpion tail that leg out, push through. Now I can even sit out if I want, pull my leg out. Um, Another option is sprawling too. It's sprawling and using my opposite free leg to hand fight his feet. So instead of hand fighting with our hands here like this, I'm doing the same thing, pummeling and hand fighting with my feet. So I'm feet fighting instead of hand fighting. So from here guys, I can come down, block his biceps. If I have my hands here, he can look for a Kimura, so be careful. I'm gonna be here, block his biceps, my hands down, and I'm gonna sprawl. Sprawl my right leg down as hard as I can, toes to the mat, get this foot, get inside, peel that off. And now I can come here, now I can start pulling my leg through. Okay? If, let's say he's got you in the lockdown, right? And a lot of us do, we're, we're smart about keeping our hands in our partner's body, so that way it's not here to get attacked. So, um, but what'll happen is Renee can grab my hips, and when he whips me up, I'll, uh, he can make, go ahead, he can make me post on this leg. See, I'm posting here, or posting here, or even posting here. Either way, he's gonna get under my leg. Boom, now I'm in trouble, okay? Now he can submit me or even sweep me from here, right? Um, so what I wanna do, guys, like, if, uh, uh, so he comes out. Once I'm here and, I, and, he, and he forces me to post, boom, and he tries to go under my leg, I need to immediately cross face and bury my hip into the mat like this to get rid of his right arm. Now he tries to pull me up with his right arm. I've killed his right arm, he has no strength and no leverage. Now from here, I can kick my leg free. See, he's got this hook, I whip it out, kick it up, pull, push pull. I can use my shin across, my knee across to push my leg out. Or, you know, I'm here, I can just come back up, right? Come back up, this is the MMA. I can start punching or self-defense. For jujitsu. I can push his arm through. Now I have a head and arm triangle from the top, right? Or I can push him over. Slide my left knee to his head and then roll his back. All right? So those are some of the, the defense and the escapes and the options you have when you're fighting um, lockdown and when you're fighting uh, electric chair. So let's go on three, one, two.